Once you've created rubrics in one class, you can easily copy it to another class using the Import Export Copy Component feature. First, make sure you're absolutely certain you're in the course shell where you wish to copy the rubric to before proceeding. So I want to make sure that I'm in the right course. So I don't want to be in that one. I want to be in my this course. This is where I want the rubrics to be copied to. And if I go to Edit Course and Rubrics, you'll see there's no rubrics here. Now what I do is click on Edit Course, click on Import, Export, Copy Components. I'm going to search for an offering. In the text search for, I'm going to type in some keywords for the course you want to copy the attend copy the rubric from. This can include the name of the section or the course that you want. And then hit the enter key or click on the search icon. I'm going to click on the radio button next to the course which I has the rubrics in them. I'm going to click add selected. Now this is really important. Make sure you click on select components. Do not Co click copy all components. If you click copy all components it will append everything in your course. So I'm going to click select components. So on the next screen you're going to see a list of the course components you can copy. I'm going to scroll down. I'm going to click the checkbox next to rubrics. If I want to copy all of the rubrics I just leave it as copy all items. If I want to copy select rubrics, I click select individual items to copy. I click continue, and now I can choose the rubrics that I want, or I can select them all. Click continue, and then again click finish. So the rubrics are going to copy, and when you get a green check, that means that the rubrics have all been copied. To make sure the rubrics are there, click on Edit Course and click on Rubrics. Now, one of the little quirks, as you see the rubrics are here, of my courses is that when you copy a rubric from one course to another, it's locked. And that means you cannot edit or delete this item. You can only use it as is. So if you do want to make changes to the rubric, you'll have to create a new one.